A CBS 8 viewer reached out to us wanting to know about all the construction along Aikens Avenue spending for several blocks near 69th Street. Now it involves several different projects in multiple agencies and I've been working on getting those answers. And they have the orange stretching material across sections so the fencing has not been replaced in several sections up and down on Imperial. Rolanda Bradley lives in the area. She's also a teacher. She saw work being done along the stormwater channel here but she says it's been a while. She's wondering what's going on. I drive, you know, past this every day, and so I'm just noticing, I'm like, okay, I haven't seen him in a while, but nothing has changed. The fence has not been fixed. She brought up several issues involving different agencies. The first is this temporary mesh fencing running along the storm channel here along Aikens. I reached out to San Diego's stormwater department. They told me chain link fencing is going to be reinstalled here. The time frame for that? October and November. She was also wondering about this. It looks like a piece of concrete there. They're pulling up on the side, I guess, so the water can flow down a little bit more easily, but they didn't come all the way down. Now, the concrete channel looks pretty good and clear for several blocks here, but she's talking about this section that needs more work. I asked the city and they said yes, they have to reinstall the concrete bank here, but the work would encroach on the trolley line. So at this point, they have no timeline for it and say it depends on discussions with MTS. She also brought up the fact that this pedestrian crossing at 69th and Imperial has been blocked off for quite some time. I reached out to MTS. They said the trolley tracks here have been sinking, so they're working to keep it on level grade and expect to be done this winter. I asked when the crossing would reopen and did not get a firm answer. She also mentioned potholes along this stretch of Aikens Avenue. I took some pictures and filed a couple get it done reports, but as far as a full resurfacing, San Diego's transportation department tells me it will get an asphalt overlay once all the other projects nearby are finished, which could be by the end of next year. I would just like for them to follow through and to be con consistent in following through in all of the neighborhoods. So if you're going to do it, do it completely, come all the way through, and so that we can just continue using our street like we should be able to. In Encanto, working for you, Brian White, CBS 8. Brian, thanks. And remember, if there's something you'd like us to look into, something happening in your community perhaps, email us at workingforyou at cbs8.com.